This is my latest invention. It's the perfect butt. As a one-time furniture maker and kitchen fitter, I was faced with a problem practically every day of the week, was when we were fitting bespoke furniture or kitchens, we'd get to the house and find, rather than we've got a nice flat wall, but we've got a wall with curves, bumps, lumps in it. The problem with that is, the back of the work surface or shelf is always, always square. It meant to say that you actually have to use a block of wood to profile that, what the wall looks like, onto your work surface. So that's the old way. It's a block of wood with a pencil in it. If you can see this, this is the profile of my wall, and it's a bit exaggerated because, uh, well, otherwise you won't be able to see it from back there. So what you do is you hold your work surface up against your profile. You then try and hold that block of wood parallel to the distortion of the wall. It is very tricky. The number of times I've managed to write off a shelf or work surface is nobody's business. Now, the perfect butt, what I've got in my hand here, absolves you from having any skill whatsoever. And the reason is, as you can see, it's got a wheel. Now, that wheel, and you've got three different sizes of it, that wheel comes in contact with your wall profile. That keeps the pencil point always exactly the same distance away from that profile, giving you an exact template of the shape of the wall. Right, we'll give it a go. The bottom half of your screen is your work surface area shelf, and this is how easy it is. Perfect butt wheel up against the profile of your wall, keep it trolling, and that is your exact template. After jigsawing, as you can see, no gaps. It's the perfect butt. Ever tried to fit this stuff? Lilo flooring, you know, the cushiony stuff. This is an exact replica of my bathroom. That is where my loo sits. Obviously, the loo's not on it. Right, it's got all sorts of difficult corners. You've got a 45 degree cut into that corner. You've got, uh, obviously, the pedestal to the loo. And out this corner, you've got a block where the pipes would run. First of all, get yourself a piece of card. Rough cut it to the shape of the area. Drop it in place. Make sure you hold the template in place. Take your perfect butt, run it round the wall, like so. Again, hang it onto your template, run round your pedestal, like so. Now that's your template drawn out. And take your template and cut it out. Lay your template onto your lino flooring, hold your template down, retrace your profile onto your flooring and cut it out. Having cut out your flooring, like so, lay in position like that and it's the perfect butt.